Hello and welcome to Scottish Car Enthusiasts and Trains TV and it's fleet update number three which is the Ford Escort so let's crack on with a um, fleet update so this is a 1994 Ford Escort LX 1.8 turbo diesel first registered on the 7th of July 1994 It's finished in Nevada Red and the alloys that are on the car I fitted these myself. These are the XR3 i dog leg alloys you'd find on a Mark IV Escort. I've just spent a little bit of money um, recently on a new back tyre on the right hand on the driver's side. We've also replaced the back wiper and we've changed the, plate, uh, the blades on the windscreen for some aero style blades. I know Hubnut won't like that, um, but I do actually quite prefer the aero blades. The car has covered 18,500 miles and it's uh, since 1994. So why don't we get inside the car? and discuss it, uh, the car in question. So as I said, outside the car has covered 18,500 miles since 1994. I've covered 990, we're not quite at 18,500, we're only 10 miles off it, but I'm calling it 18,500. So I've covered, at time of filming, 990 miles in this car since October. Um, not a lot to report on the car, um, basically it's, we're just getting it ready for its MOT at the weekend so we've had the handbrake adjusted, I've bought a new tyre, as I've said in the video I've bought new windscreen wipers front and rear, um, hoping if I get a chance to just nip under the car before the MOT time just give it a quick wax oil. Um, but nothing nothing really major to report on the car um, you'll find out with the MOT result in a later video um, so yeah costs wise it's cost me since October £1,350 um, that includes park uh, that, that doesn't include park that includes like tyres, insurance, tax um, windscreen wipers I've had the handbrake adjusted as well. Um, so yeah, it's just in fuel as well. So it's just been that's sort of, that's been the sort of cost for the car since October one thousand three hundred and fifty pounds. But apart from that, it's been very quiet on on the front. So we've covered, as I said, we've covered nearly a thousand miles, um, and it goes in for its MOT at the weekend. So we'll soon see what happens on Saturday at the weekend, but nothing major to report in this car. It's, it's great to use as a little um, retro daily or retro every couple of days type of car. Um, but no, not a lot to report on this car. Anyway, I'd just like to thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe at Scottish Car Enthusiasts and Trains TV. And I'll catch you very soon. Farewell.